Hello everyone and Merry Christmas Eve. My name is Sadie and I like to make quick cleaning motivation for you guys. I always say it's normal for a house to be messy so that's why I share mine. Listen, I had planned on not talking at all in this video because I've been really chatty in my last few, but I have a question for you guys. My husband and I were having a debate about whether or not when you brew a K-cup, like for a Keurig, does the caffeine content change when you select different like sizes? Like there is a 12 ounce, 10 ounce, and eight ounce. No matter what, you're using the, the coffee pod that has like three tablespoons of coffee in it. Just selecting a different ounce. I say that the caffeine is the same regardless. It's just one is a stronger tasting cup of coffee and one is a weaker tasting cup of coffee. He is convinced that there is less caffeine in his coffee if he picked a lower amount. And I mean, we were going back and forth with this. It was cracking us both up. We weren't being serious, but we were we were telling each other, like, you're such an idiot. Like, you don't know what you're talking about. Doing that back and forth, we weren't being serious, so don't worry. But I told him, I said, I'm going to ask everybody in my next video that I make. So we'll just see what everybody else thinks. So I want to know what you think. No judgment. If you agree with my husband, I don't think you're an idiot. So don't worry. But I don't know. Just wanted to see what you guys thought. So this is the day before Christmas Eve and I just really wanted to get my house in order. My kids weren't here. My mom had offered to watch them for me. She had my brother's kids also, so my kids were very excited to go play with their cousins. And although I really wanted to go home and take a nap, I decided to go home and clean. And you see all those cookies there. Me and the kids had made cookies the previous day. We like to make cookies every Christmas and deliver them to all of our neighbors on the street. So I'm gonna share a cookie recipe with you guys because I didn't make enough cookies, so I'm gonna make some while they're gone. And this one was so good. My sister-in-law had made them, so I got the recipe from her and they were so easy to make. I hope you guys are having a great day today and thank you so much for all the support on my channel. I love seeing that I have returning viewers. All of your comments make my day. If this is your first video, leave a Christmas tree in the comments. If this is not your first video, leave a Christmas present emoji. Oh, the dreaded dishes every time. This is one of my least favorite things to do, that and putting away laundry. What about you guys? What is your least favorite? And I really shouldn't even complain about dishes. I have a dishwasher and I would just be lost without it. I do know people with a dishwasher who don't like to use it. They prefer to hand wash their dishes. Cannot relate, but more power to you. All right, I will catch back up with you guys in a minute with those cookies. At this point, I was so over cleaning. So I had a coffee break and then I started on my cookies. You just add in your pre-packaged sugar cookie mix, some dried cranberries, white chocolate chips, and it's supposed to be an orange, but I used a cutie because that's what I had and I zested that and then added two teaspoons of orange juice. The recipe will be typed out in the description. But then while these were baking in the oven, I started on my room, which was what I was dreading because if you guys watched the video before my son's birthday, I said that I had shoved everything in those two laundry baskets and I really did not want to clean them. But I went ahead and made myself do it and I'm glad I did. So that's what you'll see me doing here in a few minutes is just going through and organizing all these clothes. They were all clean. I just needed to fold them and put them away. Do you guys go anywhere on Christmas day or do you guys stay home? We decided when we had kids that we were no longer going to leave our house on Christmas. We do go to church if it's on a Sunday and both of our families do things before Christmas. The kids are back. We got these cookies packaged up. We also made some chocolate covered popcorn and we headed out to deliver to everybody. And of course it started raining as soon as we left and it was kind of icy, but I hope you guys have a great Christmas and I will see you in the next video.